Let's talk about Credit Suisse. It's vacating a London office building. Oh, that's no right. mention of yeah. It's the other news. It, there's no there's no mention of Brexit. Is this the cost cutting thing? Yes. Well, obviously the bank and you know embarked on a pretty aggressive mm. co cost cut uh, plan a couple of years ago, which saw you know a significant shrinkage in London, and that was well before uh, you know the Brexit mm. news. And of course now we're going into the phase 2018, where all banks will have to start putting their Brexit plans into action. So from talking about them to actually you know to implementing them because they need to be up and running by you know March 2019 April 2019 and at the moment there's no indication of you know whether there's going to be a transitionary period and what that will look like mm. so they have to prepare to be able to operate from the continent and talk this week and talk this week from Prime Minister May that you know Michel Barnier the Brexit man in in the EU is, is is bluffing when it comes to financial services I mean do, do banks listen to that do they take that with a pinch of salt up until now we've sort of heard you know consistently there you know everybody's planning for the worst so that you can be operational uh, fully operational uh, when Brexit happens